the women and men of tomorrow. This is electrified. This is what you should be driving. Daniel Craig may be saying goodbye as James Bond, but his iconic Aston Martin is saying hello to a new electric chapter. Bond drives the DB5 model in the latest movie No Time to Die, but it's the DB6 that's regarded as the epitome of British motoring style. In a modern twist, the DB5 and DB6 are now being retrofitted to reappear in limited numbers as electric cars. David Lorenz is the CEO and founder of Lunas, which specializes in making classic cars electric. For me, these are the cars for future generations to enjoy. You know, for the women and men of tomorrow, this is electrified, this is what you should be driving. You've got the aesthetic beauty, which you will never get in a modern vehicle yet the aesthetics can now be combined with modern powertrain. Each electrified Aston Martin DB6 will undergo an exhaustive bare metal restoration, described as remanufacturing. Technological upgrades include the latest brakes, suspension and steering, along with air conditioning and electronic infotainment systems. The electric powertrains give the car a range of 255 miles. Lunas already electrifies a number of prestige cars, including Rolls-Royce, Bentley and Jaguar sports car models. Lorenz says the company was founded to take upcycling to a whole new level and answer a tricky question. When internal combustion engines are banned, what are we going to do with the two billion vehicles already on the roads? I want to preserve these vehicles for future generations to come. My daughter's three years old. When she's of driving age, she will be driving electric cars and I want her to enjoy vehicles like this. So how much does it cost to give the iconic Aston Martin a new lease of life? An ultra cool one million dollars. And first deliveries are expected in the third quarter of 2023. But what would Bond say when his beloved DB5 no longer makes that throaty roar? Yeah, Bond has always been about modern technology. I mean, Q would have loved to hand over the keys to an electrified Aston Martin. It suits Bond to the team.